talk talk a little bit about so i know qualities you know a passion of mine starting starting out from a clinical standpoint before coming in into this business uh over five years ago but one of the biggest things when i talk to people about quality or you talk to somebody if we're trying to fill a position at a leadership standpoint it's a common theme of we want somebody that can help us with our quality culture and, right. and take quality across the organization uh, and, and so that everybody has skin in the game for quality and that it's a proactive environment versus reactive or right. quality police. So, you know, first of all, that's important whether you have issues or not. And this example, we're talking about integrations, remediation. Can you speak to the importance of that culture and how you've been able to do that successfully at your school? Right. Okay, so that's that's a very good question. So, you know, first of all, we need to understand what the role of quality is. And so the way I approach it, it is quality is not a policeman, but quality is a partner to the business that works very collaboratively with all the other functions in the organization to reduce waste, improve the process, improve the systems, and make make the business go better. Uh, it, it also focuses on reducing the risk either from a compliance point of view, regulations point of view, or even uh, from, a, from a patient point of view. And how can we meet or exceed patients or customers' expectations? So that's the role of quality that, that I believe in. Uh, and that happens by collaborating with, with, by working together as a team, uh, the leadership team coming together and focused on the common goals and objectives for the business to be successful. Uh, and so, and once we understand that that is the, the role of quality in the organization, it helps in finding the right individual with the right mindset be, to be able to lead the teams and be successful in the company. Because if you don't understand uh, the, your, your cohorts, what their pain points are, what's important right. to them, because that communication is so key and it is a partnership because you're not always going to agree upon everything. That's right. If you're, if you're able to listen, to understand, and then identify the key things that you want to accomplish, that's how you're going to get buy-in and trust from others, right? To that's right. That's how it goes, right? Building the trust and be also, you know, learning, learning the business itself. So, you know, quality is not going to be able to exist in a siloed environment. It is part of the business. So, uh, the role of quality is also to understand the, you know, what the business does, how it functions, how it, uh, you know, what are the goals, what are the objectives, and and then plans out as to how we can get there. Uh, and so that's an important concept that we must, uh, you know, focus on in the role of quality organization. 